Hi Elvis fans, I love this interview, brings a big smile to my face and when I listen to the interviewer and the tone in her voice and a young innocent 21 year old Elvis in 1956, the way he flirts with this interviewer is so charming. Let's have a listen. When will you be on TV next? September the 9th. Any plans for marriage? And the interviewer is straight in there with a killer question. Elvis, aged 21 in 1956. Everyone wanted to know the answer to this question. Just keep cool, huh? Well, what do you think of your future in, with rock and roll music? And I don't think Elvis could have even dreamed about the kind of success he was going to go on to have after 1956 and in 1956. It was phenomenal, but he just hoped for the best. Well, I wish I knew. You wish you knew? Yeah. Well, I wish you the best of luck. Thank you very much. And uh, don't be so nervous. I'm not going to bite you. <laughs> I love the way Elvis's voice sounded at that tender age of 21. And he puts the interviewer at ease and she carries on. Well, you know, I traveled all over the city of Detroit looking for good rocking tonight. Is that right? I sure did. So it's the interviewer's turn to flirt with Elvis. And she makes it pretty clear in the way she speaks and the sound of her voice that she is mad about Elvis. And I don't blame her. Well, why don't you come down to my house and I'll give it to you? Well, I would have loved to. And Elvis is straight on the case. You can tell that he likes her. Where are you from? Memphis, Tennessee. Memphis, Tennessee. And how old are you? 21. 21? Yes. You still out looking for a girl? Uh, and she's still trying. Could you imagine if an interviewer now did that? It, it just wouldn't happen, would it? I think I found her. You found her, huh? You. Oh, well, thank you. You like blondes or brunettes? Oh, I like all kinds. All so, kinds. Yeah. And I think her forwardness is paying off. And who knows what happened that night? Who knows? Thank you very much, honey. And, and don't be so nervous. <laughs> and he puts her at ease again. The most wanted man in the world. And she's talking to him. <laughs> Nothing to it. I think I could have gotten an interview with the president quicker than I could with you. And this was so true. He was on all the TVs around the world on the front of all the newspapers and magazines around the world. He probably was the most spoke about man in the world as well. I've enjoyed talking to you, and, and I'll see you again. Yeah, I'm going to stick show. around listen to the show. And I bet she did stick around. I love this interview because you really can feel the tone of Elvis's voice. His youthful innocence comes through, but at the same time, the way he flirts is so charming and comes across so friendly and likeable. No wonder he was the most popular man on the planet. Thanks everyone.